Hello everyone, welcome to Rare Snapper, my name's MJ and today uh, we're going to have a lot of fun. I'm playing X23 for the first time, as I record this I haven't played her yet, um, but this first deck that I'm trying is a pretty standard sort of Nimrod uh, rampy style deck. Uh, so we've obviously got the brand new X23. Uh, we're going to destroy her with Carnage, Venom, Deathlock, uh, we've also got Absorbing Man in here to copy some of our destroy effects. Um, the idea is to ramp up, hopefully uh, on turn 5 we're playing one of our, well hopefully we're playing Nimrod early on turn 4 and then we're playing our other big stuff on turn uh, 5 um, uh, with like Null or whatever and then we can Zola Null or we can destroy a Nimrod. Uh, we can boost up Nimrod in a couple of ways so we've got Forge in here uh, and hopefully X23 won't land, land at the same location as Nimrod and we can, I've gone blurry, uh, and we can pull off the Hulk Buster on Nimrod. So those are the main combos, hope you enjoyed this video, let's go. Okay, first time using X23. We didn't pull her on turn one, even with Olympia. So we're halfway through our deck already, and no X23, which is fine. Turn two is currently looking like Wolverine, right? Oh, they get theirs. So I hope you enjoy this X23 stream, guys. Um, God, Elysium. I mean, less, you don't you don't not snap back in uh, in PG. Um, the the question is, Forge into Wolverine doesn't feel bad, but I'm I think I have to save Forge for Nimrod, right? Let's just do this for now. Um, do I forge now? No, I don't think I forge yet. Let's let's see what happens. They forge, Deadpool, <laughs> Carnage. I think they're doing slightly better than me. I would say. I think they're doing slightly... At least it's showcasing X-23 very well, though. So they're they're about to drop their Nimrod, probably, because they can play a 5-cost card now. Uh, there's our Zola. Okay, so let's go Deathlock into Forge. And then at least we're going to have a big Nimrod, I guess. Actually, we're going to have Null. We are going to have Null. I mean, they, they, they will probably have Null as well. Right? <laughs> But no, bloody interesting to be fair. Okay, they get the Hulk Buster off on their Deadpool, which is now 26. Interesting. That is interesting. I mean, Null is obviously huge. Uh, mm, bloody interesting indeed. The, the play is obviously Null into Zola, but I mean, uh, yeah, I guess... I sort of have to do this, right? And then Hulkbuster Carnage. Oh, we've got Minty Chew. We have got Minty Chew. Good morning, Resonation. Good morning, Minty Chew. And we've got Jay. Morning, everyone. Um, yeah, hello, everyone. Welcome. Um, this is an X-23 battle. Um, I'm happy to be showcasing the brand new card, X-23. Uh, of course, I haven't drawn it yet. My opponent has, though, and has now got a 52 Deadpool. Uh, the concern is ever-growing. That, that, that 39 Venom is bigger than my Nimrod currently, which isn't ideal. Um, but we can do this. Uh, we can do this and this, which is sort of the best thing we've got so far. Uh, let's see what happens. How's things, Rez? Uh, J oh, Jay says he's exhausted. Preach. Why are you exhausted? Brosk. Um, okay, good. So we got, we've blocked mid. That's interesting. They have played Nimrod and Deathlock. So they've got on 102... Their 102 Deadpool goes somewhere, I can confirm. Oh, I can move every... Oh, I can move cards. Okay, that's interesting. So I think if we move that and that, and do that, that's just the best thing that we can do, I would say. Although they play their... They don't play their Deadpool. Actually, I should have played Null left, actually. Because they wouldn't have played... Ah, uh, can I... Ah, that's a shame. 
Yeah, I actually would have lost anyway. Could I have won? No. Impossible to win. But, a very, very good showcase of what X23 does. It was, of course, the only card remaining in our deck. So, my first game with X23, it was, of course, the only card remaining in our deck. Why aren't I conceding? It is early. Hello, Gulliver. <laughs> I was like, what's his name? Gulliver. That is Power Region Pace's Gulliver. Um, good. Well, at least we've got X23 this time, but um, it's, it's, it's foolhardy not to simply... Well, let's, let's see what happens. We've got X-23. Normally, I'd concede. It's proving ground. I'd normally concede, but we've got X-23. If they have got turn 1 X-23 again... Right, I'm not being funny. And I had to top deck it. Yeah, I drew it this time. Purple Aardvark. Uh, they will, of course, have their Carnage, though. We don't have anything playable. Um, so, there's their Carnage. Oh, it's Wolverine. Okay. Uh, well, there's me for being... There's me for being cocky. Some things never change. Um, Hulkbuster feels like a trap. Let's go Deathlock. Because actually, this is an interesting thing to say. This is actually going to be a pretty common thing. That you are destroying X-23 on turn 3. Which means that on turn 4, you can play a 5 drop. Now, unfortunately for us, we don't have a 5 drop. Um, so it's somewhat useless. However, we can at the very least Absorbing Man. Which isn't the worst thing. Wow, Minty Chew says, looking radiant this morning, Rez. Uh, not feeling it, to be honest. Oh, good! We can do Hulkbuster Forge. Well, I think I, think I have to destroy... I have to destroy X-23 again because I've got so many 6 drops and I need to get rid of this damn more. So it's probably going to be Destroyer next turn. Um, okay, fine. She goes left. And they get the Hulkbuster Deadpool off again, which is obviously absolutely terrifying, which we love. Um, we're on six, so I can... I mean, I could Zola. Is that stupid? Yeah, it's absolutely very thick. Um, right, so I'll turn, I'll turn, uh, our final turn looks terrible here. Absolutely dreadful. And there's their Carnage. So they drew all the cards that sort of do well, like Wolverine and, and Carnage and, and everything. I mean, we are matching here, to be fair. Uh, there's Venom. Hmm, that's probably not enough, I'd say. Uh, well... Venom, Hulkbuster, that is the best we've got, and it's terrible, they do Venom, uh, so yeah, this this is unwinnable, unless um, something lands mid, actually, which still is bad, uh, and we lose right, quite emphatically, actually, um, good, X-23, oh, we actually won left, wow, that's crazy, um, no, that was so that was total feces dog shit. Uh, I think you'll agree, but good in a way. Uh, I don't think I'm upgrading X23 to be honest, because I'm I want that variant. I want that Venom symbiote variant. Um, right, so we haven't managed to get out. That just basically didn't go well. Let's go again. It didn't go well, but I don't want you guys to feel disheartened or for your spirits to be low, because it went well for our opponent. Didn't it? And that's the, that's the same. Like I'm doing it, it. We had the same deck, really, didn't we? I watched some of the streams uh, I missed on YouTube, Res. Nice channel, mate. Wow. Thank you very much. You are too kind. You are too kind, Carmoon. Um, wow. Top deck X23. We snap on that. Plus one energy doesn't help us unless we draw a miracle. Um, because we now have no one drops. Oh, damn, what a shame. Um, I think X-23 is still fine here. Wouldn't it be funny if they played armor? 
or Cosmo. Um, if joking apart, if we do see a lot of armor and Cosmo, I will play um, like Ghost Spider in this deck. I think she's going to be key to combating some of that stuff. Um, although the difficulty is you sort of don't know it's coming down until it comes down. Okay, so they're obviously playing a destroyed deck as well with Phoenix. Ooh, this is nice. Okay, so this this feels lovely. Wolverine and, and X23 is a clone of Wolverine, right? So X23 and her clone dada. Her clone dada. Iron Fist are playing a tr more traditional move deck. Bloody Nora. Um, oh, hell yeah, let's go. Do we go Deathlock or Carnage? Uh, I think... Uh, well... Deathlock is more power and more energy efficient, actually. Whereas next turn we might... Uh... Oh my god, they Hulkbuster it. Wow, Hulkbuster's being an absolute lad, isn't it? Uh, we do sort of need our bigger cards, though. Like our, you know, Nimrod, Null, Zola. And we're going to have five energy to play with this turn. Uh, okay. They're separated at birth. That's a shame. Oh, okay. We can get we can get uh, Nimrod out early with then um, Hulkbuster. Okay, this feels this feels excellent now. This feels arousing. This is rousing me and is arousing. Can you guys guess how many uh, caches it took me to get X twenty three? Look at this crackle coming through, coming through the card back. Uh, right. Oh. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, this is this is surely a win. Don't see how they beat this. Don't see how they beat this. Craven and Vulture are certainly not going to do it. They're lining up for turn six Heimdall, one would have to assume. Their Heimdall plays right, leaving them 16 right. Uh, they go... Uh, they're adding... Uh, 12 mid they would would they have the biggest no they wouldn't have even have the biggest energy thing uh, so we go forge for uh, they're gonna have 16 right actually so yeah we need to we probably need to play venom oh no no it just has to be this doesn't it has to be this that is a win uh, this 11 goes mid so I think we win right and left here. I don't think we win mid. Wait, if that's the case, we just play forge right, isn't it? Slight, it's slightly more power. That seems correct. Oh yeah, and then we also get the Wolverine land as well. The Wolverine can block left actually, which would uh, we'd actually lose. We'd actually lose if Wolverine blocks left. Does that mean I should actually play Forge Wolverine like that? No, because not adding that much power. I think it's this, but we just have to hope that Wolverine doesn't go left. Seems fine. It it it'll all go. It will all be for the best. I promise you, it will all be for the best. Wolverine will go mid. Nothing ever goes wrong in this game. You always have to have faith. There you go. I believe in the heart of the cards. Uh, what did they do on top of Heimdall? Or did they not Heimdall in the end? Wow. Manage toi. So I would say that is that is that is how the deck should feel, and they've done the respectable thing and retreated. Um, yeah, I would say that is how the deck should feel. And that felt good. Getting the Nimrod out early felt good. Uh, even though we didn't even... Honestly, sort of didn't, don't feel like we actually like drew, drew that well, really. Um, I don't think we drew amazingly. 1985. Wow. 1,985 medals, if you're counting. Let's tick off some of these, though. What we got? Win a location with four cards. Easy, easier said than done. Not. <laughs> honourable win. Very honourable. Respectable, to be honest. Um, 
Yeah, this season's gone by quickly, isn't it? Like in a, in two weeks, it'll be the new season, the old, and we'll be we'll be smashing Loki. That'll be my next early early morning stream. Actually, two hundred credits there. We'll grab them whilst we can. Uh, yeah, that'll be my next early morning stream. Uh, Loki, because that's going to be hella hella fun. Yeah, enjoyable. Okay, so that felt really good. Um, it would be nice to get some null stuff happening. Really, or get our destroyer out early. Really keep destroying. Is Laura Laura Kinney? Is that it, right? X twenty three. <clears throat> um, yeah, absolutely classic. Uh, this isn't the hand we want, but it's the hand we've got. No Wolverine, no... Yeah, this deck does feel bad when you don't get Wolverine or X-23. I do wonder how crucial Deadpool is. Wow, they're playing armor. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Okay, at least we can get out of the early Nimrod. So we wanna, we're want to. we looking for Hulkbuster next. We're looking for Hulkbuster. Um, I think we can probably snap. They've lost armor. We get an early Nimrod. I think we're okay on that. Nothing can stop us. Nothing is impossible. Nothing is impossible! We're going to do this. Okay, X-23. We actually want her to land left, so we have a shot at... Wow. Oh my god, they've discarded... They're a zoo deck and they they got Blade and discard... That is freaking hilarious. Unfortunately, I can't get the six drop that they're going to get. Let's just check their hand. Free in hand. Um, I think it has to be this because then we... Well, we can destroy her next turn, can't we? So maybe it doesn't have to be this. Or do we play this just in the event that they don't block? Probably smarter. Probably smarter. I think they have to do this every time to get the free six drop, though. Ah, oh, Kitty. Nebula. I actually sort of want to play something here. Oh, God. Hmm. That's actually bloody unideal. It has to be this. Oh, shit. Hulkbuster will still work. It could hit X-23, but it's, it's it's more likely to hit Nimrod. Nimrod's definitely going middle. X-23 only might go middle. Oh, fuck me. This is sick. This is fucking sick. What we got? Are we going to... Do we think we're going to keep that Titania? Do we think we're going to keep Titania? Where does she go? Hmm. Hey. Well, could, could be a woman in there. Could be Shuri. Oh. I got locked up. They won't let me down. They won't let me because I got locked up. Do they play right? Hmm. Okay. Well, we can't do... We can do very little here. Uh, we got priority. I think I actually have to kill Titania. I think I have to kill Titania. Oh, uh, this is a bit of a nightmare, actually. Do we think they play right, and thus I just do that to pull Titania back? This is a bit of a gamble. I don't know if we keep Titania here. If they play one, we want them to, to see. An, we want to see an an odd number of cards here, or we need them to play one card here because we're playing one to pull Titania back. We basically need Titania here to win. This is sort of fascinating. If they play two cards right, we lose. Oh, bastard. We've lost. Absolute fucker. How? How? how what? How, sorry, how are they playing so many cards? Am I confused here? What just happened? Oh, that was their free six drop. Dickhead. We wouldn't have won anyway, even with the... Uh... 
yeah, fascinating. So Destroyer would have destroyed uh, Titania, so we still wouldn't have won unless. Oh, unless X twenty three went right, they would have been on twelve. We would have been on thirteen. Fuck, I forgot that X twenty three was seven, even though she's seven. Clearly, oh, that was dickhead alert. That would have been an absolute epic clip as well. So they're playing Armor and Professor X. So they're really trying to screw the destroyed boys. Such as. Such as. Right, this is looking a very top-heavy hand. Uh, Armour's gone mid. Midders. Shutting down our Venom play there, which would have been massive. Um, interesting. Uh... I think I'm actually going to play... I'm going to play Absorbing Man because we don't know what we're doing with him yet. Jingro is forcing us mid, which is fine. Well, it's not fine. I'm not thrilled by it, but... Uh, next turn, at least we can get these two... To yeah, they've just fucked us here. So they're, they're literally playing an anti-destroyer deck. Um, which they are absolutely fucking us, to be fair. Uh, well. We don't even have X-23 or Wolverine, like our stuff that can regenerate and benefit from being destroyed. This is absolute butters. Uh... Tough deck. Yeah, impossible to win against for sure. Shanna. I mean, that's going to fill up a lot of stuff. And Baku and Agent 13. Uh, right. So we sort of need one of our low cost cards here to win. Which we're almost guaranteed to pull. There she is. Um. That's not wholly stupid. Actually, this is like... Um, this is actually losing the lane. No, I think it has to be this, but it's still a loss. Oh, they didn't go big... Oh, uh, that's interesting. They didn't. Yes, yeah, so that Val. They, 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 they've literally got the anti destroy deck. And it still didn't beat us that badly. Oh, good. Carnage reveals last. Annoying. Yeah, they didn't actually beat us that badly, did they? Look at that. It wasn't It wasn't a total decimation. Even, even with all of their counters, they didn't do that well against us because we drew like absolute shit. Like, we drew, we drew terribly. They drew every counter on curve. Armour, Jean, um, Blah. And they still only barely beat us. That's how strong Destroy is. Um, right, so they get Hood. So now they, they may have an even stronger curve this time. Uh, I think if we bait them with Wolverine... Because then I can X-23 Carnage in a different location. They go Demon there. Uh, so let's do this. They go Gene there. That's interesting. So we actually sort of want um, X-23 to go right. Oh, beautiful glory. Although we do not want to kill Null. That's absolutely disastrous. Although that is bad for them. Because it's nearly filled their location already. Uh, unfortunately has to be... Uh, probably Absorbing Man, I guess. The problem is we're going to have to keep... I probably should have gone Venom there, actually. Venom into Absorbing Man. 
Uh, don't know what we want here. Probably X23 again to go right. We're getting lucky with the X23s here. Oh, yikes. Um, okay, actually, that's not bad because it means that when we can... when we Oh, shit. See you later, bitch. Uh, Zola is interesting here. Do we go Zola Venom? Or should we go Venom and then Zola? Although, if they armor... No, we got Pryo. I think we might do him here. Is it this and then into Zola final turn? We can get the extra power here away, so I think... And we're going to maintain priority. They can only get up to six. Oh, they've already played Kazar. I think we just win this. 14, we're on 20 here. They need to play six. They need to play six mid. I don't I don't exactly see it. I don't exactly see it. Armour isn't enough. I mean we haven't seen what massive cards they've got, I guess. Oh, Valkyrie. Maybe they Valkyrie right and play a one drop uh, left. Uh mid, whatever it is. Unless they called the Zola, in which case they're crazy. Oh, X-23 goes... Yes, look at that. Get the fuck out of here, boy. Get the fuck out of here, boy. Pussy. Uh, anyway, I'm going to concede to them. Because <laughs> uh, I, I think that's enough. I think that's, I think that's well enough. Um, no, X-23 feeling strong. This is... This is probably not the best deck. Ooh. Deathlock getting some, some some boosters. I like that. This is probably not the best deck to showcase X23. However, I will say that still feels good. Still feels good. I mean, you saw that deck there. That was a deck of counters. Jean Grey, horrendous against Destroy. And we still managed to eke out some wins. Maybe we got lucky with the locations. Um... The Professor X and the uh, the um, Hulk Buster, but in any case, that was a fun first deck to try. Thank you if you're watching on YouTube. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.